Hello everybody, welcome to Stories by Shelley. You've chosen such an awesome book. It's Trick Learns About Numbers. Oh, I wonder what this one will be about. Should we have a look? Let's see what our wonderful story is about today. Trick Learns About Numbers. Oh, you're just in time, said the peacock. Just in time for a grand parade. It will start from here in one minute's time. Hmm, aren't we lucky? We made it for the grand parade. Trick and the birds looked around. A parade? asked the crow. Where is everybody? Hmm, if it's a parade, there should be lots of people, shouldn't there? I'm the parade, the peacock said proudly, spreading his wings out in a colourful fan. You may join my parade if you wish, but kindly keep far behind me. Oh, isn't the peacock just beautiful? Look at all his lovely feathers. Wow! The peacock set off, strutting down the centre of the road. <laughs> That's a silly parade, said the seagull. I'm certainly not joining in. I must agree, said the crow, that a parade of one is very strange indeed. Is this the parade? said a very deep voice behind them. May I join in? said another. Trek and the birds turned around to see two elephants. Ha! Huh. Look at that. Of course you may, said the wagtail. Two elephants are just what we need. Then climb up, said the elephants, and we will be off. There's Trek climbing onto the elephants. Are they going to follow the peacock, I think? Oh, look at that parade, said the three women, who were filling up their water pots at the well. May we come along? Of course, boomed the elephants. But stay far behind. We don't want to step on your saris. So we've got one peacock, two elephants, and now three ladies. Oh, look, cried the four water buffaloes in a nearby field. It's a parade. May we join in? Of course, said the ladies in their saris. But please keep far behind with those muddy feet of yours. So how many water buffaloes are joining in now? One, two, three, four. Four water buffaloes. <gasps> Five monkeys looked down from the roof of the temple. They pointed their fingers and laughed. One, two, three, four. What you need are five more, they called. Very well, snorted the buffaloes. But keep far behind. We don't want to get onto your monkey. We don't want to get into any monkey business. So the five monkeys joined the parade. It was a very good parade and everything was going well until. Can you count who we've got in our parade? One, two, three, four, five. Yes. I wonder what happened. Everything was going well until... <gasps> Stop! roared a tiger, rolling his eyes. No one comes past here until I've had my supper. <gasps> oh dear, a tiger has stopped them. Help! screeched the peacock, backing into the elephant's trunks. Stop! trumpeted the elephants as they sat down on the lake. Lady Saris, whoops, cried the ladies as they slipped in the buffalo's mud. Whoa, warned the buffaloes treading on the monkey tails. Eek, squealed the monkeys as they ran up the jackfruit tree. Oh no, look at this chaos. The jackfruits crashed to the ground and bounced several times, rolling towards the tiger. The tiger didn't wait, and off in a flash he went. Whoosh! Now 
jackfruit are very big. So he's very lucky that the tiger got out the way. Otherwise, it would have bumped his head. All right, said the peacock as he dusted himself off and tidied his feathers. If you're quite ready, we will continue our parade. All join in and please keep behind. <gasps> Do you think they're going to be able to carry on their parade? Ah, it's now photo time. Where is everybody, said Trek. Please take your seats for the photo. Now let's see how clever you are. Do you remember who should go where? Who was in the front with one? Who was with two? Who should sit in the three red chairs? Who should sit in the four green chairs? And lastly, who should sit in the five yellow chairs right at the back? Hmm. I wonder if you've remembered. Let's see. I will sit here, said the peacock, as I was the star of the show. There are two chairs for the two elephants. There are three chairs for the three women. Please ask the water buffaloes to take their seats. And there's one chair for each of the monkeys. There we go. Did you get it right? Smile, said Trek. Click. And he got the perfect picture. Did you like learning about your numbers today? I hope so. Do you remember who was sitting in the chair for one? It was so nice having you join me for story time. We'll see you again next time. Bye, everybody.